What's going on, guys? It's Trinity Tribe. It's a quick uh, collective message. All right, I was in the kitchen cooking, and I got a lot of downloads. So, um, I don't know. Maybe some of you guys um, are chefs, or you guys are cooks. You cook really good or something like that. Or maybe when you're cooking here, um, it's, it's magical. Maybe if you start getting in your kitchen more, using your hands, some messages that you're looking for, answers will be coming to you. But, um... I was hearing Eminem's song. What do you say? I said, I'm sorry, mama. I never meant to hurt you. I never meant to make you cry. But tonight, I'm cleaning out my closet. All right. Um, so there's a masculine here about to have a conversation with their mom. It's a mother figure. It's, it's something like that. This masculine, um, I also heard is about to tell their mother that they got somebody very promiscuous pregnant. Now, this mother is going to like be like, oh, well, what were you thinking? Or she might start like basically bashing this masculine for something that he's telling her. And it's like he's going to air her out respectively, though, because I don't know. Like, I feel like this this woman that he went towards was kind of like made in his mother's image. If this is a sister, or aunt, whoever, somebody is made in this, this person's image, right? Um that's one story but i'm also hearing a, a, another toxic situation like there was a mother here who was supposedly like helping i'm hearing this king find his wife and it was a bunch of options and i think this this mother picked somebody who was like her but she did it on purpose because i feel like if she would have sent him towards you she would have been excluded because you and her or nothing alike. But I feel like at this time, this mother here is trying to operate out of your energy and make it like she's you. She could be saying that you're demonic. You could be a tarot reader. You could be a spiritualist. This mother here was making it like you were either a witch or you were evil. And the person who they put them on, who was very promiscuous, I'm also hearing like a sex worker or somebody gets paid for their services. If they don't get paid for their services, this is the type of person that they feel like they got to get something out of sex. Like if they sleep with somebody, they should be getting money or something gifts. This is not somebody who would go towards somebody for love or for pleasure or for marriage. It's like... Well, I gave you some sex. What do I get in return? And not like somebody who wants a relationship. Say if somebody you slept with a person and, you know, you was hoping to get a relationship or like you actually wanted to be committed to this person. This person who they went towards is the complete opposite. It's like, well, I gave you sex. Well, where's some money or what can I get for my services? It's something like that. This mother sent this person to that person. And I'm feeling like at this time here, this masculine is triggered because he could have got this person pregnant and this is kind of like a continuation from last night because i feel like he's watching you at this time and you guys are high vibrational high vibrational match it's just that this masculine doesn't trust himself so he believed whatever that wicked witch told them now also i'm getting um uh, i'm drinking my water y'all make sure i get your water in the day i'm also getting um Whoever this feminine is that this masculine gets counsel from, she gets readings and she's trying to make it like, I guess she's a religious person or she's getting readings done actively on you, like constantly doing it around the clock to try to see what's going on with you so she could get in that energy. All right, give me a second. And this was all so he could disregard you. All right. Um... Come on, Sean. Let me concentrate for a second. No, 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 yeah, yeah. No, no. I always but mommy said he has to, but I I protect you, so you have to play with me. If you protect me. Mm -hmm. Okay, so yeah, that's what that situation is. It's codependent, so I, that was very significant. Um, this mother is acting like she's some sort of protector to this masculine. In all reality, she's trying to lead him astray. Sean, this is very rude. Please stop. All right. Um. So they two could have been taking action against you because I feel like here uh, something started going on with this masculine's life, and she started telling him, um, 
well, soon as uh, we got around this person or X, Y, and Z, this is when things started to fall down for you. And he started believing it. So he started doing magic on you. So I feel like here somebody's remorseful. The last couple of days I had a masculine um, keep coming in my dreams, multiple masculines. I want to say I've seen three masculines in the last couple of months. But this one I seen the other day, I don't know if you work for this person or this person used to give you money. It's like this masculine left you behind. Y'all were supposed to be partners or something. And he got out the car and he was like, wait here. So he could have wanted you to take the back seat or he just wanted you to be in the back of him instead of like being together. And then he said, it, it, he named three women and he was like, these people make me feel better. And then he left you in a car, but he handed you a wok full of money. So... I mean, I don't know what that was about. I don't know. But I also feel like here, whoever this masculine is, I heard you revived him. So it's like you healed this masculine from something. He started to come out of his shell more. or It's something like that. Um, but he left you. He took your energy and he gave it to somebody who was karmic yeah the shift like he changed on you or something like that you helped him change with your knowledge here because i've seen the ancients yeah po possibly you were praying for this masculine or you said a prayer for him and it's like he took action against you so it's like he could possibly be losing everything that he built off of your energy because it's something here that you and this masculine have in common something you guys are both passionate about yeah we have accept your gifts it's something here that you and this masculine is gifted at and you resurrected him and he tried to leave you behind or belittle you put you in the back seat make it like you was insignificant you wasn't important i just seen uh what was that 655 on the phone so somebody may want to look that up and it's just like now without your energy there's no action with this person yeah we got warrior woman I don't know, man. This person tried to defeat you or, um, yeah, the light. Yeah, you brought this masculine to the light or you brought life to them, more light into their life. I'm hearing more sweetness with some sort of seeds that you planted within him. This could be mentally, this could be physically, but I also feel like here, this person was supposed to get you pregnant and he got the wrong person pregnant here. Yeah, karmic dad. This person's like back on the karmic wheel. And this person's starting to see this here. I feel like this masculine here. Yeah, here go drought. This this person's about to go into a season of drought here. Yep. And this is death. I'm getting ego death, but I'm also feeling like with drought and darkness, um, um, and death here. This person's about to lose a lot. This is a karmic here, a succubus, a Jezebel spirit who's about to take a hell of a lot of money out of this person here. They're even sucking the light out of this person at this time. This was wrong what this person did. And it's like spirits about to repay them the favor because you're, you're of light. So I don't see you retaliating against this person here. All right. But spirit is about to with spirit of the East. They're about to, you know, this masculine is about to have a major shift, uh, that's about to happen around him for whatever he he did here and i feel like this person is remorseful all right um this person's doing a lot of crying too they offered you up all right um a lot of crying here because of this karma or they put you through a lot here they could have possibly with the death card this person could have helped you transform because you died internally this person didn't know the pain that they put on you here a lot of pain is what i'm seeing But Spirit's about to take this person through the ringer for action that they have taken against you. Let me get one more. Yep, we had Rise. This person helped you rise, and whoever they went towards helped them, you know, it just wasn't good here. All right. Sad, man. But I feel like this masculine is trying to reach you here energetically through telepathy. All right, you're telling you about these financial constraints. I don't know. I've seen a masculine hand somebody a wok full of money. Or maybe this masculine was supposed to be pouring into you. And they were doing this to this person. Um, maybe with this person being left in a car. I don't know if this has something to do with car sex. But I feel like here, maybe this masculine was paying this person for sex. And actually got this person pregnant. That's what I'm getting here. 
Yeah, we have attachment. This is whoever this person went towards. This mother sent them to them so they all could be in a loop together here, attached. So they could suck everything out of this masculine. Because I feel like this masculine here is a big deal. I'm getting emperor status or king of pentacles. This person's a boss, has a business, is something here. And they're about to lose a lot because of them not being able to see here. Or you tried to help this person see. They just didn't want to. All right. What's the message here? We got the number five there. Somebody refused to change. All right. They didn't want to. Maybe you was different. You was trying to help this person change, help this person see. Could have told them something about these people. This person didn't want to listen. Yep, about these people who were unbalanced here. But I feel like these people who are attached to them now is about to bring a lot of imbalance to their life. Can you turn that off, please? I'm recording. Off, please. Turn it off. All right, Cole, go upstairs with your brother for me. I'm sorry, y'all. I like the working. I don't like the light on sometimes when I'm working. I get a more like peaceful energy when I'm in the dark. It's my daughter showing somebody a water dispenser. I don't understand why she's doing that. We have the sun in reverse. All right. Um, so like I said here, whoever this person is who has an unhealthy attachment with this person, this person's about to lose a lot of happiness. Or when you walked out of this person's life here, you were their guidance. This is when this person's world started turning upside down. Somebody sucked a lot of energy out of this person's life and everything else. All right. Yep, the goddess of the moon in reverse, and then we have hostilities. Somebody's very hostile here about your ascension and your intuition and their lack of intuition. Because I don't know, maybe somebody just wanted to tie themselves to you for something that you know. Here, yeah, temple path. They know you're a part of their journey. They know you're a guide to them. And with the magician in the mirror, you're able to manifest here effectively. So somebody could have been trying to use you for manifestations, whatever the case may be. And you walked away here. And I feel like you're successful now. Or you're walking into this if you set yourselves free. Or they were supposed to set themselves free to become successful. And this is what they chose not to do. Because I feel like here, this is the masculine here who likes to be in control. Or this masculine just like likes people to take the back seat. Or this person ain't don't want no partner. They want to be the face. They want to be the help. And I'm pulling like a Mitch energy like... Yeah, we have empathy. I'm telling you, this masculine is trying to reach out to you here, pull on you energetically here, telling you that they, they are part of something that they're trying to break free from. And I feel like this person wants you to trust them. I feel like they are trying to handle the situation right now, but they know that you know that they're guilty. They are guilty here. Maybe they were empathetic towards whatever they whatever pain they caused you. They didn't feel any empathy for you, but now it's like they could be wanting you to pray for them or it's something here. Yep, and we have happiness. Somebody's guilty here. They felt like they were supposed to bring you happiness. Or somebody's like experiencing health issues because they was hating off of your happiness here. Yeah, with the imagination, you could be like a creative person. It's something that you do here. Yep, and you put you place this person under judgment. Somebody here was a vibe killer. I heard focus on your healing. Vibe killer, focus on your healing. Protect my energy from your bad aura. Yeah, somebody had a bad aura here due to somebody's growth. All right. And they possibly taking action against them here with other people to block somebody. It's something like that is what I'm getting here. All right. Somebody took action against somebody here due to somebody's happiness. Yeah, because they wanted something to end here. This is a vibe killer. They wanted something to end. All right, yeah, two of pentacles, they know how they felt about you here. Or it was you and a person here who they had a choice. And this person's like, mm, do I want this person here? This person seems like a little bit higher. Uh, I guess I'll take the lower because uh, this makes me feel better in my ego. Uh, This person may be better than me. Uh, let me. Let me walk away here. I, I want to be the face. It's something like that here. Yep, the eight of swords, and then they all in their head about this ending. This could be a Scorpio, or this could be um, a, a Gemini Libra Aquarius here. 
all right because now somebody's in their head here about you moving forward with the six of wands like i said you're manifesting effectively and this person was trying to block you or manifest against you here and like basically either trying to beat you to your destiny change your destiny steal your destiny give it to somebody else all right so i'm getting here this is like a warlock energy who's working with a dark witch so anything that you got going good in your life, this is when this person comes around or tries to find you so they can study what you're doing to block you. Yep, the Seven of Pentacles, and then we got the Ten of Wands. All right, somebody's very burdened here by what they've invested their time in. Somebody spent a lot of time here possibly trying to end everything that you had going on, and this is the truth. And you left this person out with the Five of Pentacles, all right? Or you wanted a divorce. You got a divorce with this person. You separated yourself. You know that this person here was causing burdens. It's like every time this person comes around, you feel the energy here. And it's not good energy. This person's a vibe killer, yep. With the Nine of Swords in the world. Every time this person comes around, you feel stress, dis-ease, discomfort, and everything else here. As this person was working against you. All right, now they're burdened by whatever they got going on. Whatever they've invested in here, it wasn't a good look. Somebody's stressed out here about a cycle closing. They know it's over. Yep, the Five of Pentacles, they know it. Yep, and this lover's connection is over. Somebody walked away here. Somebody was supposed to pour into a Queen of Cups. This could have been a twin. That's why I'm saying this person has energetic ties to you. So they could be doing a lot of telepathy here with you, trying to let you know. I see somebody trying to block this out here, though. Somebody's not looking for a 5D relationship. Somebody's looking for 3D. So this person could be trying to send you messages through the mind or send you messages musically and they can't say it to your face. All right, we got the um the Six of Cups. So it's been the ending here of a soulmate, a partnership, even a family setting here. Somebody here chose to work with the darker side of the family opposed to the lighter side. So it's like something's ending here or it already has. Yep, the two of swords, all due to confusion. This person wanted to cause you confusion. I also see here, this is a person who could have caused a lot of confusion within your family setting here. All right. Turn family members against somebody here or something like that. Yep, and it's, it's judgment here. Somebody just knows something's over, something's not effective here. Maybe this, this tactic worked in the past with these burdens and they could stop you from working or doing whatever you did so you couldn't get these gifts. And I see at this time this person's watching the Most High bless you over and over again. Yeah, with the Sun card, you get very happy. I also feel like here, whatever uh, burdens that they tried to bear on you is being exposed. You see right through this person. I heard you see right through me, Nicki Minaj. How do you do that shit? We got the Ace of Pentacles. Nothing but Aces is coming out today. And spirit just wants you to go ahead and keep manifesting. This person also know that you're manifesting a new soulmate. You could have spoke this out. This has this person in their head here. Because whatever game that they was playing is, is like really no longer effective. It's over. It's done. It's dead. All right. It's over. Whatever this, these tactics were to cause you stress during the best times of your life. So it's like whenever you was happy, this person came around and killed your vibe. And I see you being compensated with the Ten of Pentacles because of this. You're going to close out here with a lot of money due to something that you're working on with the Page of Pentacles. This person could have been a part of it with the Five of Wands and the Three of Pentacles. But instead, they wanted to cause problems here. Or you were supposed to be a part of their journey and they left you out. We got the Ten of Cups. I see some of you guys were here walking away from a family or the idea of you having a family with this person. You could have wanted this. I see this is like diminishing at this time. You're recognizing you're worth more. Yep. And somebody's like about to get karma for this. I also see with justice and the six of cups, you are going to be blessed by the most high. They're like handing it to you like this. Like here's your soulmate right here because of this rejection with the four of cups. Yep. And the nine of cups because somebody rejected somebody who made them happy due to selfishness and greediness, egotistical prideful and everything else here all right somebody was operating out of their lower self but like i said they have been enlightened here what's transpiring the confusion the illusions that has been placed within their life all right around these people this could be a cancer this could be a libra this could be a scorpio um leo capricorn towards virgo somebody knows here and reason being is because they're watching you here with the page of swords, right? 
and the Queen of Swords, you could have spoke something up here or some, or some evidence has been presented either that you're in a new relationship you told this person this or you gave this person evidence about something maybe you're a reader or you more seasoned you're very mature here you're very knowledgeable however way this goes something here somebody's watching you speak at this time and they know you're telling the truth about something because it's like something that you said has confirmed something that somebody else somebody else said or something that they went through you confirmed it and this person's trying to have the strength because they can't believe like how in tune you guys are mentally yep i see here at this time somebody is trying to refrain their sexual energy with somebody here or if somebody was paying for sex in the past i feel like here maybe you didn't want this person to pay you and maybe somebody's feeling more worthy about themselves now like wow well i don't have to pay for sex well how come I had to pay this person or this person? It's like somebody's having an enlightenment about something. Yeah, the two of pentacles, they going back and forth here. All right. Yeah, with the knight of swords about what they know they need to eclipse out of their life immediately. But I feel like here somebody's juggling whether or not they want to come towards you here and tell you that they made a baby. All right. Somebody definitely possibly made a baby here. Yeah, look, the Empress, but I also feel like here you could be an Empress who's moving forward in a lot of offers. But I feel like here they want to they want to show you some 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 something here. They want to tell you something. It's like this person's fearful of doing this, though. Instead of being straightforward and just telling the truth, I told you they juggling. They don't know if they could they should come towards you. I also feel like here somebody probably possibly juggled you. They felt like, yes, they had. Right? Yep. And it's, so I'm about to close out also feel like here they don't know how they feel about you because maybe you, you got more than them or something ace of pentacles three of swords or you getting blessed in front of their face or you got more gifts you spiritually inclined more than this person and it stresses this person out yeah with the nine of wands because of your gifts here with the queen of cups you're very intuitive so somebody is juggling whether or not what they should come and tell you this king of cups what they should come and tell you they already know that you know so it's like if they come towards you here with a lie something that you already know about them yeah an illusion with the moon at the bottom of the deck you're gonna cut this person's neck off you don't even want to hear it so this person's like battling should they even come towards you and tell you anything the hermit they watching you though i also feel like here somebody's like finally getting in tune with their emotions they want to move forward with you all right this could be a virgo last message here yeah Somebody wants to come and balance out a situation. So we got two counterparts here. We got the Empress and the Emperor right under each other. We got the King of Cups and the Queen of Cups. And we got the Queen of Swords. So this is one, two, three, four, five people here that could possibly be involved in this. Or they were in this lover's connection. Or all these energies are mixed up at this time. All right. I also feel like here, I don't know, maybe this Emperor or this King of Cups. This could be, this reminds me of like a dating show. Maybe this is like a dating show. I don't know what this is, but somebody here is trying to find their true empress, king, or queen. However way this goes. And this came out a couple months ago. The Bridgerturks, the Bridgertonics, the Bridgerton, Bridgerton experience. So somebody could have been dating around and somebody's like finding out that the person who they chose or settled down with, this is not the right person. And they don't know how they should come towards you here. Yeah, with this new leap of faith. All right the the fool they don't know how they're gonna take action and do this here because it's something sneaky seven of swords energy in the past all right um let me close this out here with some advice how should somebody here proceed or move forward or any advice for this person here spirit who's confused about coming and tell the truth or for the collective here anybody who needs a message here. All right, yeah, we have showed the world, the world the real you here, and we have bring love into the situation. So I feel like here's whoever's masking their emotions and hiding. The resolution here would be for you to actually be authentic. Somebody could be dealing with an Aquarius, or if you're masking that you love somebody, you should come forward here and tell this person the truth. I feel like the truth is the only thing that's going to save this situation here, all right? It's the truth. Somebody here doesn't like to tell the truth.
but the truth is going to help you get this forgiveness and the truth is going to help you get the success that you're looking for for whoever this is resonating and look strippers poking out of my thing clear as day so somebody could have been with a stripper or chose a stripper and then I see, does the company you keep align with your morals and values? So like I said, somebody separated here from a group. I don't know, this Virgo could be a stripper or Virgo could be involved. All right, but I do see somebody getting here increases. Maybe somebody went towards a stripper because they make more money. All right, a scammer. It, it's just like, it's a lot of messages sticking out here. Cancer. Yeah, who's scared and lonely? I don't know, y'all. Somebody could be trying to track somebody at this time. Aquarius can have a tracking device or an Aquarius need to look towards the light. All right. Somebody's like very obsessive here. And I feel like some news is about to come in with the arrival card. Yeah. To this genuine soul. Somebody hired a private investigator to watch a genuine soul who ain't really doing much. And somebody's like feeling weighed down because of everything that they worked. They worked hard against this person here. And they ain't seen nothing shake. Yeah, we got you already. Somebody needs to come forward here. So I hear grow up. I'm grown now. Yeah, and start trusting themselves. Last message here. Somebody tried to hire them private get investigator. I'm hearing to prove that they were... Like, they try to put the energy off of somebody. So, I'm getting somebody was doing spells here to make somebody look like who they actually were. And we have peaceful resolution. It's coming out again here. So, I, like I said, I think the truth here is supposed to set somebody free or possibly to bring the changes into your life that you want to see. Yeah, we have look for a sign. Angel numbers, synchronicities. And or like I said here, somebody's trying to tell you something telepathically. Last message. Yep, I told you, signs, synchronicities, ask your angels. Somebody needs to do some meditation here, all right? And we got this situation will improve at the bottom of the deck. So I don't know, y'all, there's a lot of messages here. If any of this resonated today, like, share, and subscribe.